Oh, we're gonna get day drunk today. Friends, I have worn my very favorite special rainbow holographic jacket today in hopes of matching our product. In this episode of Adara Unboxed, we're gonna be checking out a new sake soda beverage from the company SoSo. I am quite excited about today's unboxing for two reasons. The first is I love me some sake. And the second is that this product looks like it was made for me. You'll see what I mean very soon. What is so-so? It is the first sake soda alcoholic beverage. Basically a sake cocktail in a can. And by can, I mean in the most beautiful, shiny, cute, kawaii can I've ever seen in my life. Now I only know that from checking them out online, but now I have my very own box of so-so. So I'm gonna open this up and we'll see how cute they really are. Oh boy, there's a lot of stuff in here. <gasps> oh my gosh, they sent me a hat. It's the cutest hat in the world, but I think to make all of this make sense, I should open up the actual boxes of so-so first. Dun, 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 dun. That's a heavy box of sake soda. Pull here, muscles. Okay, the boxes. You guys, how is this so? Cute. From what I know, they currently have three flavors and I believe they've sent me all three of those flavors to try. This is a box of four. It is in the flavor Ringo. Ringo means apple in Japanese. And I believe all of these flavors are 5.8% alcohol. Not too shabby. Fuji nights at dawn, dry and sweet when the world lost its charm. Drink so so and help Ringo find the sweet memory of a million rainbow stallions. For anybody wondering about the healthiness of alcohol, one can has 97 calories, not too bad. No fat, 1% sodium, 1% carbs, 2 grams of sugar, and that's it! That's not bad at all, actually. This is a really cool packaging, too. It's like a butter box. Oh, it's you. We knew you'd come. Hold tight, keep going. Oh, I love this packaging. Come closer, this way. And there they are. So this box comes with four. Look how beautiful this can is. Beautiful and cute. Oh, I love it. So these are in 8.4 ounce cans. Also, all of the flavors are gluten-free, vegan, and sulfite-free. Please recycle. I haven't even tried it yet, but I know that this is the kind of beverage I would immediately buy if I saw it in a store. Only for the packaging. Only for these beautiful cans and this adorable face. Come on, I think some of you know me well enough to know that this is right up my alley. I'm gonna pull out the other flavors before we taste test these bad boys. Next up is Sakura. And I don't know that Sakura means cherry in Japanese. It must, Sakura blossoms, right? Cherry blossoms, yes. I know this much Japanese. <laughs> Sakura flavor, cherry flavor, same goodness in here, 5.8%. They call me Sakura. I was born on the run and raised in a cloud of cotton candy and so so sake where the cherry ends and the fun begins. Very cute, and the nutritional value is the same on these. Last flavor is yuzu. If you don't know, yuzu is like a Japanese citrus. It doesn't necessarily mean lemon or lime or orange. It's its own citrusy goodness. Two steps in the light Soho mist from Kobe to the Sunset Strip. Let yuzu tickle your toes and fill you with the sake goodness and citrus gold. Ta-da! Cutie patootie little yuzu. And again, the nutritional value is the same. We're not done yet. Before I try these beverages, they have sent me some extra goodies in the box, so I just wanna check those out and show you what they are. You guys, look at this hat! This is the cutest thing ever! I'm gonna wear this all the time. So cute, how sweet of them to send this. And I'm pretty sure they sent me like a really nice sweatshirt. 
Oh my gosh, how cute! Can you see it? It's a cute sweatshirt. It's like oversized or maybe it's just not in my size. I don't know, but it's like deluxe. Like this is a nice quality sweatshirt. Good on them for having good merch. Okay, let's try some drinks. First up, Ringo. It smells delicious. I'm gonna pour it out so we can see what it looks like. I wasn't sure if it would be um, colored because it is sake soda and sometimes sodas are crazy colors, but it's lovely. It's just nice and clear and effervescent. I love me some carbonation. It kind of smells like sparkling apple cider. Cheers, friends. Whoa, that's different. I think it's hard for me to describe this because I don't think I've ever tasted something quite like this before. This is not a sweet soda. It definitely tastes like sake, but it's a really smooth, mellow sake. You almost don't even notice it until the aftertaste when you're like, that's different. And then you realize, oh yeah, it's sake. It has a really subtle apple flavor that reminds me of apple Jolly Ranchers. This does not taste necessarily like alcohol. It's very easy to drink. Yeah, very nice, light, apple-y flavored sake seltzer, kind of. Except I'm assuming that they can't use the word seltzer because it has sugar in it, maybe? So soda it is. I hope y'all couldn't see that cat hair floating in my sake soda. No, I'm not getting a new glass. Don't judge me. On to the next. Here is our Sakura. I don't smell anything on this. Oh, yeah, I smell it after it's poured. It does smell like cherry. I don't know that this flavor is for me and it's because I'm an 80s baby and I have an aversion to some cherry flavored things because of certain medicines, children's medicines that I was given as a child that had cherry flavor. This is actually a very interesting topic because I've heard depending on the era, the decade that you were born, there are different flavor aversions that you have to things because of the flavors of medicine you had as a child. I have some aversions to cherry. That being said, the flavor is pretty subtle. I think that in this one, the sake flavor is covered up more by the cherry. Very easy to drink. This just tastes like, like slightly flavored seltzer water. It's, it's not overpowering. Think it would be good for cherry lovers, but maybe this one's not for me. I'm still gonna drink it anyways though. I'm not gonna waste good sake soda, are you kidding me? And last but not least, our yuzu. Oh! <laughs> Ooh, yeah, baby, that smells like Sprite. Good. If somebody handed this to me at a party, I would think it was Sprite. Maybe like Diet Sprite? I don't know. I don't think I've ever tried Diet Sprite. It tastes like Sprite, but not so sweet. I don't taste the sake as much in this one as in the apple one. However, it might just be because I've been drinking a bunch of sake soda. Maybe like I'm not tasting the sake so much because I'm drinking so many in a row. I honestly don't know how to describe it other than it tastes like Sprite. It's light and citrusy and refreshing and slightly bubbly and delish. Down the hatch. I think in all three, the sake flavor is really subtle, but it's nice if you're a person that likes the flavor of sake, like that creamy light wine flavor, you do get that in the aftertaste and it's really nice. I think out of all three, wait, I need to double check. It might be a tie. Out of all three, the Ringo apple flavor is my favorite. That's the one that I will keep on a drink in. Um, I'm gonna drink all of them, <laughs> let's be honest. So these are also naturally flavored. So these are all, <laughs> this video <laughs> is getting harder to make because I'm starting to feel the sake soda. So, 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 
So, so, so, so. So, so is also naturally flavored. Maybe that's why the flavors are pretty subtle. I prefer that. So, so is located in California. They're currently only available to walk in for purchase in some LA stores, but they are offering shipping throughout California and they are planning to be able to ship nationwide to states that allow alcohol shipments by spring of 2022. I am so grateful that they sent me this super awesome package. I can't wait to share this beverage with my friends and see what they think. And I'm curious what you think. Which of these three flavors would you be most interested in trying? Leave me a comment below, let me know. All right, folks, that's it. And it's probably a good thing too because I am feeling a tipsy. And it's at this point in the videos that it becomes very difficult to edit myself. So with that, I will wish you all adieu. Auf Wiedersehen, good night. Thanks so much for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't. I will see you all soon for another Adara Unboxed Adventure. Bye!